up, what's up, y'all? I'm back again with another video. Ooh, I cannot be like it. What's up, y'all? I'm back with another video. And this look is kind of fallish, but you can wear whatever. But I wanted to do like a cranberry kind of like eye with a, I don't know what you would call this lip, but I don't know. But whatever. If you guys like this look, keep on watching. Did y'all like that intro or not? <laughs> so I already started out with brows. Y'all know how I do my brows. I already primed my eyelids with the Prolong Wear Matte Concealer. Now I'm taking Peach Smoothie, which is a peachy kind of uh, cream color from Makeup Geek. And I'm putting that all over my eyelids in the crease to help this dark shade that I'm going to apply next blend in easy. Okay, so now I'm going in with Bitten Eyeshadow from Makeup Geek as well. I'm going to be taking that with a 239 brush from MAC and packing that on my lid. Now, what I do here is I pack on the shadow to build the intensity. Then I take a blending brush from Sedona Lace and I blend out the edges to make everything look nice and blended and smooth. And I just repeat this step until I get the intensity that I want. So now that I have the intensity that I want, I'm going to go in with Peach Smoothie again and just highlight underneath my brow bone. I learned this trick from my friend Kyra. She suggested that I use this for a, a matte under eyebrow highlight. I cannot talk today. But yeah, I put that under my brow. It's a matte shadow. It's perfect. It has like a peachy tone to it and it's perfect for women of color. So now you guys know how to do my foundation. I'm using the NARS All Day Luminous Foundation with my Beauty Blender and I do not um, damp my Beauty Blender. I just put the foundation on there as is. But before I apply makeup, I do spray Fix Plus. You guys know that. I feel like I look so scary with just foundation on in this eyeshadow. But anyways, I'm going to be taking the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer and the NARS Creamy Radiant Concealer, mixing those two together, highlighting under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose using that same beauty blender. Then I'm going to be taking the Sasha Buttercup, yeah, Buttercup Setting Powder and just setting underneath my eyes. And that is a Morphe brush. So I just put that where I highlight to set everything. Going in with the MAC Mineralized Dark Skin Finish, I am going to be putting that all over my face to set the foundation. Now I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit, the two shades Copper Brown and Cinnamon, and carving out my cheeks, my temples, and then I do go down the sides of my nose to make my nose appear a little slimmer because y'all know I got a big nose. So now I'm going to be applying the Lotus Lashes 410 Lashes camera because my camera decided to cut off and now I'm taking the wet and wow this is a black eyeliner pencil and just eyelining halfway um, on my waterline taking bitten again and I'm just gonna place that on my waterline to bring this eye look together
So now for my favorite part, I'm taking the Becca Champagne Pop Highlighter by Jaclyn Hill. I'm gonna be highlighting my face. I cannot believe I am using something other than the Elf Golden Bronzer. So I highlight the highest points of my cheeks. Oh my gosh, look at all that highlight. <laughs> I get carried away. So I'm highlighting highest points of my cheeks, temples, down the bridge of my nose, and then the center of my forehead to achieve that glowy look. And I also highlight my cupid's bow. So taking that same champagne pop highlighter, I'm going to be highlighting my tear ducts and this is a pencil brush that I got from Walgreens in like a little set. So now on to lips. I'm taking Plum Lip Pencil by MAC and I'm going to be lining my lips. So now I am taking stone from Dose of Colors and I'm going to be putting that on my lips. Then I take my finger and kind of blend everything in together. Hey. Then I'm going to be drenching my face in Fix Plus. I love this stuff. And the look is complete, guys. I hope you enjoyed this look. I love you all and I'll see you all next time. Bye.